All right, there we go. Welcome, everybody. We are on to episode 20. I had to pause there for a second because we were four, four? We were f five or six hours off. Um, I don't know what it is about the in-game time in the game itself versus actual real life time, but it is not synced up. That was very annoying. So anyway, now we're caught up and synced to our correct day, and then we're going to grab all of that. Look at that. I love I love getting just the straight water from the the filters. That's really useful. On our next major sell-off, we'll buy a second filter. That way we can double the amount of water we're producing, clean water we're producing. Ooh, let's do let's do a big glue run real quick. And then we'll head out to the next POI. Okay, we need six minutes. Six minutes, aye aye, sir. Sweet. Oh, and that was all my bones. Okay, so I need to keep an eye out for more bones. We have excess water. We don't have excess bones. All right, so here we go. Let's see what our next quest is. A lot of our quests have kind of been annoying because this particular playthrough, it's been prioritizing sending us to places that are like more commercial versus residential. So we're not getting nearly... Ah. We're not getting nearly the books that I would hope for. No. There we go. I'm not going to lie. The red dot makes it very hard to see in the dark. Watching an animal run away in the dark with a red dot is so hard to see. I'm literally like, am I on him? Nope. Am I on him? Nope. I'm like, oh. Ooh, some bullet tips. Where's my bike? Right there. Perfect. Ooh, we are hungry. Let's pause and get some... Oh, no. I don't have my water. My house is right there. Let's go back and grab some water real quick. I didn't realize it yanked the water out of my slot first. It prioritized taking my drinking water over the four and a half stacks that were just in my inventory at the time. Hi, I need my water back. Thank you. Cool. And then while I'm here, just do that and that and that and that. There we go. And we're clean. All right, tally ho. What ho a foe? Okay. So real quick here, we have a very, we have a, I think this is our, there's a coyote right there. I think this is our first infested clear that we've had this playthrough. Usually we've been getting uh, just like commercial type ones, which is why we have like no books. It's why we're on day 20 and we have horrible book um, progression so far. And it's just because we've been getting mostly commercial. Oh, that was so good. That was three sewing kits. Oh, I needed that so bad. I can make a tier three scavenger outfit now. I'm so excited for that. Okay, and then... Yeah, we're heading up. Frickin' feral. No! Oh my heck. Oh my heck. You guys. What the heck? Am I dead? Oh my heck. That was insanity. I literally stepped up onto the top of the thing and there was that is very loud. I literally stepped up. See, that is the exact thing that I hate about the machete. Did you see did you see her stagger once in eight power attacks? No, not a single stagger and she never decapped in eight hits. Oh my gosh, that was garbage. And apparently there's a cop back there. Ow! Oh my heck, what a garbage POI is this? Like rad... rads and feral cops? Good grief.
You know what? I think that's the first time I've ever killed a rad or a, a, a feral cop from damage. Like, ever. Ever. See, gen generally speaking, when it comes to ferals and rads, usually you kill them through the decap. You don't kill them through damage, direct damage, when you use melee weapons. Because their, their health is so high that you can't DPS them fast enough. I'm not going to lie, that was absolute garbage, by the way. I'm hyper offended at that. Because it was literally like, hey, I, I powered you. Hey, I powered you. Hey, I powered you. I powered that... that uh, I forget what her name is, that one. I power attacked her like five times. She didn't stagger once and just hit me five times in a row. And and then there was a rad that pinned me in the corner. And she's like, and I'm dead. Congratulations. Ooh, what's happening? Oh, my brain shut down. I'm like, how come I can't grab this? Okay, now this is the POI that has... the The final loot is literally right here. Yeah. I don't know why. I don't know why, but the game seems to think it needs to drastically increase my game stage, and I don't know why. Is that a scavenger thing? Is that what happens when you play scavenger? Hang on. I got to look at my stats here. Loot stage is 106. My level is 46. That pisses me off so bad. What's my thing here? <laughs> Longest life, 10 hours. Nice. Um, current life, 2 minutes. Cool. Loot stage is 106. I, that's one part of the... Or one aspect of this game that I actually don't know super well. Uh, uh, Lead and Brass from Sinks. Not a, not a great book, but it's not bad. But yeah, that, that's one thing about like... Like zombie evolution stage versus player stage that I don't really know very well I was gonna say I think I'm okay that's straight up a wandering horde that just showed up at the house that I'm at hang on also I need a, a vitamin or whatever I always forget which one it is it's a it's a vitamin I need a vitamin hey come here y'all are noisy you're going to wake up the neighbors. Yeah, see, look at that. Look at that. That pisses me off so bad. I just one-tapped both of them. And then that stupid ra or stupid feral, I power-attacked to the face eight times and then died. Pisses me off so bad. How is... Um, oh, I was going to say, I'm not going to be... I'm not going to be getting points for a while, so... Oh my heck, another... What is happening? Like, straight up, what is happening? How come we are on to, like, exclusively rads? I literally just went from, from one rad on... Look at this! That's three rads! This one POI has had five rads! Are you freaking kidding me? What garbage is this? Where's my, where's my house? I got to go get a vitamin because I'm not fighting. Yeah. This one house had five rads and three cops. What the crap is this? Is that POI? That is insanity. It's like infested clear. There was five rads and three and three cops of which at least one or two of them were feral. That is an absolute garbage mission. I am not even remotely high enough of a level to have that level of of enemy that is insanity i wonder if it's because i'm playing scavenger because scavenger greatly increases your loot stage i really wonder if it's something to that effect but weirdly enough i've never run into that before that's weird i don't know i will say that i am very pissy this episode though <laughs> oh i had a vitamin on me what the heck when did where did that come from i don't even remember having that and then dump you parts. 
Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. That that royally pissed me off. That that mission did. Like that was such a garbage mission. The game's like, hey, we're just gonna let the enemies wreck your face. Hope you're hope you're okay with that. And it's like, no, <laughs> absolutely not. Ooh, three of our cement mixers are done though. Okay, so I require armor crafting kits. Hey, how you doing, Ren? You just missed me getting massacred. I just died. It was hor horrific. It was it was that classic the machete sucks moments. Or the the machete sucks moment. The game was like we're gonna we're gonna let a a rad and a feral pin you into a corner and not let you decap either of them and not let you stagger either of them. It was garbage. I literally just stood there and died. I was like, "What the crap is this?" All right, pears is a ready to eat meal, so put that there. Dump those there. Construction says sand. Miscellaneous is going to inherit the armor parts because otherwise I lose them. Okay, and then I need a scavenger. I need a scavenger outfit level three. Leather and forged iron. Ooh, I don't have enough iron. Okay, let's get some iron going. We'll rewind after I'm done. Oh, yeah, it was garbage. I was so mad. Okay, so I require uh, just, just one. Just give me one. And then give me... Yeah, crap. That's going to take a long time to get a second one going. The other the other option here is to grab some more iron and just double up iron for a little bit. Like, pull this out and just double that up. Also, though, we did get the research and technology to get up to cement mixers. So I, I have four cement mixers. So I'm really excited about that. I need... I had grapes last night. How are you? Again. Okay, I'll take I'll take some. Okay. I'll take it in and have them look at it and tell them they messed something up. I was wondering cuz it was kind of clunky when I drove it the other day for you. Say what? That's fine. Don't don't worry about it. What is? Oh, so you had to drive across? It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I mean, I was already there. Yeah. Well, thank you for getting me a sandwich, though. I do appreciate. I'm work planning on being debt free for a while. What are you thinking? I'm seriously wondering if we just need to get you a new car. We just put six grand into my wife's car and it's already having issues again. That pisses me off so bad. So here's what we do. We buy you a cute little smart car. And you can it can be your cute little um ferry around town. Yeah. Uh let's scrap that and get our piece back. I do want some fries though. Fries look good. I just died, so this this episode is a waste in a slow time, a slow episode anyway. I'm not gonna lie that that mission that it just sent me on pissed me off so bad. There was I counted I think five or six rads, and at least three cops, and at least one of the cops was a feral that I saw, as well as two or three other. Uh, zombies were also ferals. Like, it was all ferals and rads. It's like, dude, it's day 20. Why am I fighting exclusively rads? Like, what is this? Yummy. 
<laughs> All right, let's modify and throw that on there. Get us a little more armor rating. 6% better quality on our looting, apparently. It's only two a level. That kind of sucks. But knowing how that works, it'll probably say that by the time we hit level 20, it'll be like 15% or 20%. Which would still be pretty sick. Were you noticing any issues as far as like being able to change gear or anything? Were you noticing any issues as far as like changing gear or anything? Like, is it I rough riding like it, or anything? I feel like it changed long, it took longer for it to. You know, when you speed up and your RPM goes up and then it yeah. shifts and goes back down even though you can't see the speed? Yeah. It felt like it took longer for it to do that. Okay. Hmm. I might have to end the stream early today if that, yeah, that should be annoying. Call the dealer and be like, guess what? You didn't fix my wife's car. It's still broken. Um, I'm not sure. The main concern is where it is brand new. It shouldn't be throwing errors immediately. The part I'm pissed off about is the fact that we just put six grand into your car for it to not be fixed. That's the part that pisses me off. Hey, look. Spent mixers. Well, I gotta con I gotta seriously reconsider my life if that's where I'm at in the game now. If if we are officially moved on to like full rad uh, POIs, like that's going to be an issue. We are not even remotely ready for that kind of a a jump in difficulty. Like we literally went from hey we have a rad at a location to full rad. And that's like, no, we're not even remotely geared or ready for that. Like, that's insane. <clears throat> oh, bad news. Medicine's getting low, so you should stock up while you can. Let's see. So we did an infested clear, and it was straight rads. There was a crap ton, and they were all rads. This Let's try... The best way to get... Do hurry. I have a protection... I'm going to try just a regular... I'm going to try just a regular mission and real quick and see if see if it's okay or not. Because that was garbage. It, it literally was like I, I opened up the very first room and got pinned and killed by a rad and a feral. And it was like, why is there a rad and a feral? And then I turned the corner and there was one. It was an infestation, but infestation doesn't mean doesn't mean the absolute hardest enemies. Like there were five rads in two rooms like. I'm I'm currently at the point in in my missions where I'll do a I'm only on I'm only on tier two missions. Like why why is there five rads on a tier two mission? It doesn't matter whether it's an infested or not. I'm not even remotely high enough a level for that. Like that's just garbage, you know. That's why I was so pissed off. Is it was like what is this? Like this isn't even remotely what my level is. And we'll see here in a second when we start this one. Okay, so that one's a feral. This one... Are you a feral? No. You're just a regular. And then there's somebody downstairs. Are you a feral? Nope. And then I always forget. Is there a, a loot thingy up here? There is, sort of. Okay, grab that. <clears throat> Nothing down... Nothing down here. There's a hatch over here. Come on. Yeah, 
Because the, the issue is that regardless of whether it's an infested clear or a regular mission, there is still like a, you're only so high of a level, right? And that's the part that pissed me off is it was like, that was by far the hardest mission I had had in like ages. Like that, that mission that killed me just now was by far the hardest mission I've ever had in, in this, this playthrough. And, and it wasn't even close. It wasn't like, oh, that was kind of hard. It was like, I got massacred. I got massacred. And then the very first, and then the very first second I respawned and stepped back in, it was even worse than when I got massacred, which was why I was so blown away. I was like, what the heck is going on? You know? Oh, I've already been to that way. Hmm, it seems to be looping on itself, which means we need to go this way. Any more snacks? That's a... Oh, I was going to say, that's a snack. No, that's a pile of trash. Oh, that's a snack. Got him. Okay, and then back. Oh, let me through. Okay. Anything else out here? Okay, I think that's everything down here. Feral? Not a feral. Feral. See, so here's the thing. So look at what we fought this mission, right? So far, we've had, what, three ferals and and uh, the rest were regulars, right? Not a single rad. Not a single rad. Ooh, I'm officially one-tapping those. That's really cool. That makes me happy. So happy I'm going to have a bite. Mmm, pickle. <laughs> I tried, bounced off the side and fell in the hole. <laughs> All right, well, I'll call the dealer again and tell him that they something's wrong again. Spider. You're so obnoxious. Someone's coming behind me. Hello. Sir, you're going the wrong way. Yeah, see, compare this mission to that last mission. There was not a single rad on this mission. Not one. Kitty. Hi, Berlioz. <laughs> Level up. And then I want all of these because the, the springs. So springs are kind of kind of slow to grind up. There's only certain things that give them. There's a fair amount of things that do. Um, they're just generally slow. Yeah, I'll eat them. Give me one sec. Ooh. Fiber into cloth, cool. I mean, it's a relatively worthless book. Cloth is literally everywhere. 
like just this one i'm at 77 cloth from this one poi like yeah. cloth is literally everywhere okay where where's my where's my bicycle bicycle this way <laughs> i have the technology i'll get out He's like, I want love and affection. Where's my bike? There's my bike. Hi, Dag. Hey, man. I got massacred on a garbage mission. It was stupid <laughs> like l like literally stupid i had a tier two spawn over five rads three cops and four or five ferals that i saw and i just straight up died it was like and it was one of those moments where it was like hey i'm using a machete that has a really high decap chance and then I didn't get a single decap, and I just got massacred. I just got pinned into a corner and died. I was like, what is this garbage? Kitty. Good sir. Monsieur de la Flouf. In fact, I might actually ride back over to that POI and see if it's still, like, wild nuts. If it is, I'll, I'll step back in and show you. But let me let me turn this quest in real fast. Oh no, I'm encumbered and slow. Oh yeah, I'm. I'm there, there's there's no hope. Go 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 go. Thirteen encumbered. Thirteen encumbered. Hop. I know you. I knew you had it in you. Wait, Here she you knows go. me. What? Who? I'll take your wood. <clears throat> We're and we're gonna we're gonna try it we're gonna try another infested and see if it does the same thing again and i am gonna go back to the other location too that was the one that gave me the problem yes i work tonight <laughs> chubby bunny yeah yes i do work tonight we can throw down some more phasma if you want All right. Oh, I'm so encumbered. I'm always down for more Phasmo. I love that game. Wait, hang on. Stuff here is not going where it's supposed to. There we go. No. I do have another ergonomic grip I could do something with. There we go. I was like, I have way too much garbage in my inventory for this not to be like doing something. How does one obtain pipes? Break sinks. You want to break sinks and toilets with your with your axe, and that's that's how you'll get pipes. Uh, at least till you get a wrench. Once you get a wrench, then you can wrench literally anything, and you'll generally get some. Cars, I think, give you pipes. Pretty much anything inside of a house that you wrench will give you. Boys, what is up with you? I am finishing my lunch real quick. 